Hello, Libras. How are you doing? Welcome to Celevi Tarot. Let's take a look and see what's happening in love for you during this time. Um, if you are interested in a personal reading, everything is below where we will take a look at your person and what's going on with you. So what's going on with Libra and love? Okay. Someone here wants you to chase them, Libra. Someone here is wanting you to chase them. Someone here is coming in and saying things became too difficult here. Too much emotions involved here. A lot of stressful emotions. Someone here is seeking to have power in this relationship. Like having power at this time is making me literally feel like I'm in control. Okay. So it's interesting because I feel like Libra, like you may be a little bit, a, a little bit, disappointed in this person or even a little bit upset with this person okay that's just the energy that i'm feeling i'm feeling like you feel like someone wasted your time or sort of dragged you along or this person really um hasn't really expressed their true desires but i feel like because someone here knows that this connection is severely strong and it has a lot of intensity I feel like this person seeks to have control and power over this relationship at all times. So this person may come off like they don't care or they're coming off as if, again, I'm unbothered, okay? But I feel like you're starting to notice that this is something here that could be a bit childlike or a bit a waste of your time to some degree, just, just to some degree. Like, I feel like there could be a lot of distance or someone like created distance between the two of you, but... Again, I just get like this intentional energy, like someone, it's like they're doing it on purpose. Like I have to create this space in order to get you to the level or get you where I want things to be. It's interesting, Libra, because I feel like you're on to them or you're on to it. And I feel like you've been doing your own thing lately, honestly. You could be actually focusing more so on work at this time. Like work could be something that's very, very prominent right now, or there's a lot of, um, there's just a lot of busy energy around you, believe it or not, here. I'm too insecure to deal with this situation, right? Yeah, and Libra, I feel like you've made, you've actually come to the conclusion that this has been stressing you out as well, Libra. Yeah, you've been trying to distract yourself. Like, I have to distract myself, Salavi. I'm trying to ignore this here. For some of you, you're possibly still, possibly still in love here. And if you're not in love, I feel like you're trying to not think about this here. Like I'm trying to do other things so I don't think about it. I'm trying to make myself happy in so many other ways so I don't think about this. But it's like wherever I go, this is on my mind here. Some of you just want this person to be real. Like I just want you to be real. I want you to be straightforward and I want you to possibly stop lying. I'm getting lying as well. Like someone here felt like they were lied to. Or you've been lying to me about a situation here. How does Libra currently feel? What is the truth behind Libra's feelings? What is the truth behind Libra's feelings here? Yeah, like you feel like, oh, you feel like there's so much obstacles here. You feel like there's so much in the way of this connection moving forward. Some of you, you feel like communication's at a halt. You feel like basically your hands are tied. There's not much I could do. I have to stay in this position of coming off like I'm unbothered as well, right? Like you feel like you're not being your authentic self. You feel like, you feel like a part of you also has to be dishonest in terms of how you feel and how you're presenting yourself. And it's like something that you really don't want to do right now. Some of you could be dealing with another Libra and you feel like this is someone here that's lying about or they were lying about a situation that you confronted them with. Especially if you're connecting with a Gemini, Aries, Sagittarius, or Leo. Some of you are starting to pick up that this person is not authentic. Right? They're not, on, they're not authentic. They're not being straightforward here. And I feel like if I call this person out, um, again, there may be bigger issues. So for, a part of you really doesn't want the, the drama. Like, I don't want to deal with the drama. I don't want to call someone out. You possibly realize something about someone or you know that they're lying about their emotions. 
I just feel like Libra is wanting to leave the drama behind. That's what I'm feeling. You're feeling like this is like um um 80k marathon to get to this person's soul. Like, why is it so hard to get to this person's heart here? Or why is it so hard to get this person to reveal the truth? So let's take a look at your person here. Okay, let's see what's currently happening with your person's energy. Libra, someone here wants you to chase them. I mean, for some of you, it's like, I'm so done running after you. Let's get more with this person's energy towards Libra, please. Oh. Hmm. I feel like this person sits around and they try to figure out, oh, wow. I feel like you're connecting with someone that feels like, what if I miss out on other things? Right? What if I invest in one thing and it doesn't work out for me? So a lot of you are connecting with someone here that really hasn't found exactly what they're looking for. They don't know what they're looking for here. They doubt themselves, right? They doubt this energy of, you know, releasing and allowing things to flow, right? It's like this person doesn't let things flow. And spirit is just like, just let it go. Let the boat flow. Let things just rock. Let it be. And it's like they just want to be in control mentally, emotionally, and the reason for that is, again, this person, I feel like they haven't really made their choice here. They haven't made their choice. They haven't made their choice about this connection. It's so interesting as well because one minute this person walks away or is attempting to walk away or attempting to, again, release things here. For some of you, maybe you've gotten this feeling of this person wanting to walk away from something. Libra. You could be connecting with a Cancer, Pisces, Capricorn, Sagittarius, or Virgo energy. I don't know if I said Pisces, but there's just this energy of, I want to let it go, but then this person comes in wanting to communicate. So there's a lot of mixed signals here, honestly. There's a lot of mixed signals, and I feel like that's one of the things here that's possibly frustrating you about this connection. Um, one minute, someone here really doesn't know what they want, they want, and the next minute, this person's possibly offering you friendship. There's something about, like, friendship that comes in, some sort of communication that comes in, and you're just like, wait, I thought it ended. Now, I feel like for a lot of you, Libra, there's this, there's this urge here, okay, the Justice card, that's all you. There's this urge of wanting to make things right. Like, let's just make things right. Let's just leave all the drama behind and let's just balance things out. Let's come to a fair agreement, okay? Um, and I feel like in the last two days, three days here, someone has been like holding back and fighting this urge to come towards you and tell you that they miss you, okay? I do feel like this is someone here that holds back a lot. But one of the things that, again, you may feel this very intensely of like this urgency of possibly reaching out to them or possibly, um, you know, just kind of like ending ending the war or ending the drama here. Because I feel like, Libra, you really want to be social. Like, I feel like you want to come out of this stagnant energy. You really don't want to be in that energy any longer here. You want to make amends here. It's a strong wanting energy. And I feel like you're wanting to seek peace. You're wanting to focus on the relationship. You're even for Libras that are single that are tired of this. You're wanting to pursue, uh, you know, a better relationship with someone here. You're not wanting to um, go back and forth with someone. So things could be a little tense right now. But I do feel like there is a possibility of again more being revealed here because your person's coming in and saying I still want to talk I still want to communicate and that could be your opportunity honestly to work on um, a better sort of communication now Libra I do feel like this is a message I want to get to you if you feel like you've been storing a lot of like hurt feelings and you've been suppressing a lot of emotions and you haven't been really expressing them or finding ways to release them you know, it's important for you to start possibly working out, finding physical activities to do and not store those emotions of sadness and hurt within your body. I'm just getting that someone here needs to move around a little bit, needs to do more, needs to be a little bit more active. Okay, so if Libra's person had something to say, what would they say at this time? Yeah, this is a big opportunity for cleansing, Libra. Like do a cleanse. 
I just feel like you've been through a lot and there's just like you need to have like a checkup honestly let's get some more Libra thank you wow so this person's coming in and saying the grass definitely wasn't green on the other side here okay and again I feel like this is someone here that wants to come in and initiate or start something with you again all right, so I do feel like, again, this person's coming in and saying what I thought I wanted, I wasn't sure, and now I want to possibly clear the air. So I do feel like you'll get that opportunity to speak to someone and connect with someone, okay? Have a good one, Libra. Again, if you're interested in a personal reading, everything is below. Have a beautiful weekend.